you got to look after yourself, you got to be good with people. Exercise. There's a lot of confusion on what being a man is these days. If I kiss you right now, it should turn me gay. How does having a Bugatti and a cigar come with massage? That's why we're here today asking all types of different men about what it means to be a man. What is it like to be a man? Well, oh, let's not go down that road. To not beat women. To be... My perspective right now on life is to stay motivated, train as much as possible, yeah, I can see that. well. <laughs> what does it mean to be a man? Strong, probably a leader. Are you trying to be that? Well, <laughs> in some aspects, yes. What other aspects are you not trying to be a man? <sighs> aspects like to be motivated in life. You've got to exercise, you've got to look after yourself, you've got to be good with people, you got to enjoy, you got to get the microphone close to your mouth, <laughs> exercise, eat healthy, you know, don't eat crap. I try to keep my testosterone up naturally. What do you do to keep your testosterone up? I eat a lot of cholesterol, <laughs> I was all scared of cholesterol. I eat a lot of carbs, a lot of fat, eat it all. I just try and keep it as natural. So anything that grows in the wild, runs in the wild, swims in the sea. Raised Christian, but I would say agnostic at this point. Agnostic means you don't believe in anything at all, right? Yeah. What is your opinion on what a man is? Well, I know it's a pretty tough subject right now. It's uh, getting a lot of traction, or has. But in general, I would say for myself, it's fulfilling the role that's required of me. And currently, in the relationships that I have with various people around me, that would be anything really. Being male on the other hand, I mean, that's kind of biological. I would agree. Ah, to be a man is to be a creation of God, of which I think you've got only one purpose on earth, that is to worship your God. When your time is up, you go back to your creator and you will be judged according to what you've done in this body while it's on this earth. That's what I believe. And a party hard. You Really? You drink? Do you yeah. drink? No. You don't drink. So you no. party hard, but you don't drink. Yes, I don't That's drink at all. That's awesome, bro. I That's don't believe, I don't think there's any point. What's the point of drinking? I mean, it, it suppresses you. 33 degrees, like 33 spines up in particle, particle can, particle, particle. What does it mean to be a man? It comes with the, the traditional term of the sense, being the man in the relationship. I would step forward instead of my wife. I would like to protect her. That's where I fall in. Doing DIY stuff, I love it. My wife hates it, so why not? You are a man. You identify as a man? Yeah, I do. What for you does it mean to be a man? It means... You don't have to rap this, by the way. I rap supersonic. I'm bionic. I'm like a trigger that I never put my fig on it. What does it mean to be a man? Uh, I guess it's um, wherever you feel like it, I guess. Because, like, like, you know, obviously, at the moment, it's uh, right, a let, let, a... let, let's, let's forget about all of that. Uh, depends if you actually stand by it, then it's fine. But I want to know what it actually means to be a man. To not beat woman. To not beat woman. To not beat woman. And what kind of extent? And to train every day and be the best you can be so you can be an example for the kids. I gotta rap to like, can't no more. Are you like gay or something? Or? Me, no. Like, okay, no, like, no, double, no. Check, double check it, double no. check it. It's okay, it's so, okay, yeah, if it is. I, like, no, I my brother's gay, he's married. So, okay, perfect. Yeah. Well, that, that, well, that, I'm not gay, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, in a way, like to say, you know, if you're a man, you like, can't cry, you know, that stereotype. If you're a man, ah, you can't cry, I'm, I'm not, can't not really, that. That, that is what like, you probably think that being a man is, but so much brighter than that, yeah, right? No. You're still young, you're 17, yeah. you haven't seen the world. Have you had a girlfriend before? Yes. Do you have one now? No. You don't have one now? Okay, well, I mean, you're young, brother, you haven't yeah. seen like anything of I haven't of experienced life properly. I mean, I've never been out of South Africa before, even. That's, I mean, a lot of people in South Africa haven't been out there, but yeah. that doesn't classify you yet of not being able to be a man, right? I get you. So, I'm gonna give you my opinion and my opinion may be wrong I don't want you to completely get my opinion if yeah. anything I want you to just listen to what I have to say pick the things you think are cool and just use them for yourself 100%. but you know also the issue with people's opinions they're fucking yeah. they, they listen to somebody like yes everything that he says is correct but it's not always the case <laughs> I get you. you know what masculinity is just being a protective provider in a non overpowering way I guess what do you do yourself I model and then also own uh, quite a few companies so that's why I'm able to just come out and do this Okay, so you're an um, entrepreneur, yeah. you already have things going for you. Pretty much, yeah. Are you working online or what are you doing? Online, yeah. Okay, so, so you yeah. can even travel the world, you're a digital nomad. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. dope. It's also for me important to understand what your frame of mind and thinking is, right? For sure. Because we're out there asking different types of men about what their opinion is on this matter. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'd love to see what everybody's frame of mind is in. I feel like you have a very sober and good way of thinking. Uh, honestly. Sure, man. Well, <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah, sure. Is there like anything else you would consider to be like, if you think of a man, what would you consider being a man? A man, I mean, look, I mean, nowadays, I mean, I guess it's just not being a douche really and just uh, and being uh, a brother in a way, being protective and 
looking out for you know those who need it. I'm so quiet actually. I'm, I'm strongly about it. Um, uh, 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 our nobility doesn't lie in, in, in being superior to your to, to your fellow man. Nobility lies in um, in in superseding the person that that uh, you were yes sir. So, sorry, come on, come on. Sorry, I'm just like really, really, really tired. <laughs> Take a deep breath, say it again. Um, uh, uh, yeah, I'm trying to think of you know, the exact words, but um, nobility doesn't lie in being superior to your fellow man. It lies in being superior to the person that you were yesterday. Okay, that's dope. So you say an actual man is being superior to who the person you were yesterday. To yourself. So it, if, it, if you're it, better it, than it, you were just, yesterday, that makes you more of a man today. Yeah. You're completely right with that. I also don't think you need to be overpowering or like manipulating or whatever, but yeah, yeah. still, I really want to know from you what it means to be an actual man. A man is the provider of the family. A man is the head of the family. A man is the keeper of the family. And mostly we can see that the men are leaders, men are protectors, men are fighters. Men are almost like everything. They are dominating the world. Not necessarily saying women are weaker, but I'm talking about men. They are the fathers of the community, fathers of the countries, fathers of the nations. Would you consider a man not being a man if he doesn't apply to these standards? <sighs> Look, I mean, old school wise, I mean, you know, it's, it's that, 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 that um, you know. Let me give old. you a quick little lesson. You have two types of energy between men and women. Yeah. You have masculine energy and feminine energy. Masculine energy is predominantly in men. Feminine yeah. energy is predominantly in women. Yeah. But it can be both. Yeah. We all have a little bit of masculine and feminine energy inside of us both. Yeah. Right? She's a woman, she's right now filming. She has masculine energy and feminine energy together. But yeah. the percentages are different. Yeah. I think personally, I'm probably I'm like 90 to 10 percent, right? You are probably 80 to 20 or maybe even yeah. less or more, depending on how you are. Yeah. Problem with most men is that they don't embrace each side well. Those become those lazy fucks that don't go to the gym, that don't eat healthy, that lay yeah. there purposeless, wank off every single day, maybe twice, four times a day. You never know, right? Yeah. That is a weak man. So here's the little bombshell on top of that. Yeah. If you don't embrace your masculinity, that's fine if you don't want to be that masculine type of guy. But if you have that in you, you should. Yeah. Masculine traits is having a purpose and chasing behind it. Being lost is not very masculine. Yeah. If you want to be a masculine man, if you want to work for your goals, that's yeah. the energy, taking, going for it, being competitive, yeah. that is masculine. That's doesn't doesn't mean a female can't be like that, yeah. but still means that it is masculine energy. Yeah. But the little loving part, cuddly part, that little softness, you know, the being, giving, taking care yes. of someone, that, that is very feminine. Yeah. So do you have, there, do you have the different types of energies? Okay. A lot of men, especially nowadays, I mean, you just came from the gym, as I can see, you're yeah. still walking back. Yeah. It's very masculine of you because yeah. you're trying to work on yourself, work on your body. Yeah. Before you know it, you try to make your own money because you want to be able to provide for yourself, your family, 100%. Your, your friends, your, your, your wife, future wife or girlfriend. 100%. Right? That is masculine. You have that already in your heart. Yeah. So you have the masculine energy already. But if you want to be able to up yourself, it's about you being able to read into that and knowing what it actually means to be a man yeah. if you want to be that. I get you. My next question to you is, what do you think it means to be a man? Being a man, I think we both can agree that the purposeful going after things, that being able to provide the courage and going after something like you said, that is what it means to be a man in his masculinity. Yeah, but yeah. that's important for men to understand. At least that's what I think. We would both agree? Well, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, for sure. That's a part of it. I 100% agree with you on that. Yes. Yes. My man, but thank you, you know so what much. they say oh, okay. yeah. about no. mas uh, Mas masculinity. Yeah. Mas masculinity yeah. Yeah. Yes. Is that real men wear pink? 